Hi, I'm Brandon Flynn, and I am joining Justice LA and Reform LA Jails to amplify important stories. Today, I'm honored to amplify the testimony of Mark Avila, a plaintiff in a lawsuit to hold the LA Board of Supervisors and Sheriff's Department accountable to the public. There is no denying that my privilege has protected me from circumstances that Mark experiences. So today, the best thing that I can do is use my privilege to get his story out there. So, here it is. I am a 33-year-old Hispanic man. I have been incarcerated since November 2019, awaiting trial on nonviolent charges. Due to jail conditions and my serious pre-existing respiratory conditions, I am especially at risk. I am housed with about 25 other men. I am not six feet apart from the prisoner in the cell next to me. I have heard other prisoners in my module coughing. Since March, I have daily asked for a mask or protective gear. Until April 10th, I was told no. They know that I have chronic asthma. On April 1st, I submitted a request form seeking a mask. On April 9th, I submitted a grievance form asking for a mask, hand sanitizer, and other necessities for cleaning. I have not received a response. I have not seen my pregnant wife and four kids in months. It is my fear that if I contract COVID-19, I will only have a 30-minute phone call to speak to my kids before they lose their father. I want to meet my newborn child once he or she is born. I am afraid I will die in jail. The sentence I am facing for my nonviolent charge is not eligible for death much less death by COVID-19. Thank you for watching and listening to the end. If this story touched you like it did me, please join Justice LA and Reform LA Jail's teams. They're suing to save lives and looking for people to step up as citizen plaintiffs in this lawsuit to show solidarity with those in our county jails. Please join them by going to bit.ly forward slash suing dash to dash save dash lives. I'll tag Reform LA Jails in the comments so you can get involved. Stay safe, stay healthy, we'll talk soon.